Hello everybody, this is Malabar TC1. We are continuing in Final Fantasy XV Pocket Edition. We are on Chapter 4. The Disk of Kothis crumbles into ruin. The roads are closed and the regalia has vanished. Noctis and his friends find themselves stranded. Ooh, so exciting. We're going to see how this story continues onward. Obviously, I have beat Final Fantasy XV before, but the pocket edition with all the chibi forms is pretty fun, and I am enjoying going through this, so yes. Let us see what Noctis and his friends are up to. We had just gotten Titan in the last video, so if you guys missed out on that, you can check that out. And, uh, yeah, it's loading up. <laughs> Funny how the Empire claims to be the ones who have dealt with the Titan. Wow. It's totally political propaganda at its finest, right? It's ridiculous. <laughs> Same thing happens in Final Fantasy XII. There's always this political, like, you know, cover-ups for everything that's going on. I think a lot of Final Fantasy games have that sort of aspect in it, Final Fantasy VII with the Shinra Corporation, Final Fantasy um, uh, X, the whole, you know, church of whatever, they're covering up the truth behind everything. Yeah, a lot of it happens <laughs> throughout Final Fantasy games. I'm just, <laughs> it's a common theme. Chocobo post. I still can't believe it. I mean, shouldn't the car have turned up by now? We should wait until Cindy's done asking around the Lakuka Rajas before we dispel. Let's not fool ourselves. The Empire has it. Then maybe we could ask Arden to help us out again, right? The Imperial Chancellor. <coughs> he represents a problem. <coughs> Approach Umbra. What? Don't I want to check out the room this place first? wondering if the thing was still there. I was like, is something uh, gonna happen? I wanna look around the place first before I continue in the story. I'm always an explorer. Look at a chocobo post, of course. Of course I gotta check around here. A tree and three barrels of hay and a car thing, okay. I'll keep that in mind. Let's see, we got some stronger stuff here. Rune Saber. Okay, that's much stronger. Do I have enough stuff though? Let's, uh, let's sell the junk I have first. Treasures, yeah. Sell all treasures, yeah, yeah. Oh, good, good. Okay, yes. Confirm and equip. And uh, this is up, okay, let's go. Let's do that. Let's confirm and equip. Always try to get the strongest stuff. I don't think I'll be using that. Okay, that is stronger. Yes, equip that. Soldier's armlet. 
What's that do? Doesn't doesn't say. Just makes it enhances vitality slightly. Oh, maybe I'll get it. Maybe I won't. I think I'll be good for now. Let's hold off onto some of our money. Three barrels of hay. Ooh, this could be it right here. It's like something right here, isn't it? It's like really close. This is like the exact spot. This is ridiculous. It's like literally, it's like literally like right here. Come on, this better be it. There we go. Lol. <laughs> A big silo, three barrels of hay. Okay, okay. Keep looking around. Oh, this is definitely it right here. Check that out. So it's like right here. Really? Come on. <clears throat> there we go. And uh, five barrels of hay and some wood stacks. Okay, good to know, good to know. Five barrels of hay and some wood stacks, it's, it's like right here. Oh, got a cactuar. Crazy about cactuar. Does not want me to to dig. Let's see, it's behind the barrels of hay. That's why. That's why I can't dig in front of it. Imperial Medal of Honor. Nice. Go us. You guys see more cactuars? Make sure to point them out for me. <laughs> Oracle with Bahama, I remember these things. Draconian descendant, mortal ray realm, did an antenna brave from handpicked pious maiden, joins the earth. Okay, sounds good, sounds good. Yeah, I get the chuckle about. <laughs> He's just running away. Oh, there's one. Wait, what? I've come up with a new recipe. Oh, cool. I just probably need one more thing for it. All natural guys over here. Ooh, and I can get on the chocobo. Got, got that. Can't leave yet. Okay. It won't let me leave. So that's definitely where I'll be going after I talk to Umbra. There's a lot of stuff around here. I wonder if it will finally let me race chocobos. It didn't let me do that at the beginning of the game. Like you could do that in the normal game. Yeah, you go there, attaboy. Oh, so cute. Beauty of a bird. Hmm. <laughs> no wrong way to love a chocobo. Aw. Super cute. Give a little chocobo a hug. So cute. Oh, there we go. Yeah, found the cactuar. How far does this go? Okay, I was gonna say, does it just keep letting, letting me go and letting me go? But there's definitely one more piece of the food puzzle that I need to get for Ignis. He's coming for the new recipe.
I don't know if I got both pieces. I don't think I did. Oh, well, if I can't find it now... Can I get behind here? Is there... It looks like there could be items behind here if I get behind there. No, it doesn't look like I can. Okay, I guess it is time for Umbra. We'll walk around the park one more time. And then I'll go talk to Umbra. Yeah. Looks like we've pretty much done everything we can get. Okay. Cool. Let's go talk to Umbra. Hey, girl. I'll chase after Umbra now. Well, if we're gonna be chasing after Umbra, might as well see if we can leave this side of the park then. There might be stuff up here. Nope, okay, okay. So it's gonna force us to leave the other direction. Oh, what the, can we rent a chocobo from here? Rent a bird? It won't let us though, oh darn. We have to walk on foot. <laughs> that dog. <laughs> I would love to have a dog that looks like that. It's pretty cool looking. The black and the gray with the yellow eyes like that. My prayers are with you, Noctis. Lady Luna Freya. It won't let me choose the options like in the game where you just like tell her off like whatever. <laughs> She's got a really weird olive shaped head. I know you won't. At least the young version of her. <laughs> olive. Like a like a green olive.
that entails passage aboard a ship. Kaya may serve us now as it did them then. The hidden harbor. Not only that, Odin just come and land the blockade. Oh, Have you a set up? Yep, still there. Sure as sun up. <sighs> How long is this gonna go on for? Excuse me. Oh, there goes Umbra running off. Look at that, running off and moving forward. Perfect. You get so much more experience from battles. But this game only has like a limited amount of experience, so you want to really fight everything you can, or else I don't think you make it to max level, maybe, unless you read the chapters. Little frogs. Holy smokes. Look at that thing. That thing's huge. Don't want to fight one of you guys yet. Not until late game. He's come up with a new recipe. I don't think I could fish. They didn't even give me a fishing pole in the game or anything like that. Ooh, fire though. Well, I could definitely eat these guys. <laughs> I remember you can make the mana steak stuff in the game. Like with these guys. I can't remember what they're called though. Like they're gentle creatures, but we can literally take them down. Perfect. Wow, so much extra experience. Should I try to kill one of these big guys? They won't let me. They won't let me fight it, will they? <laughs> They're just kind of there for now. Maybe we can fight them late game, if ever. Kill these things quick. Yeah. Noise. Go us. Nice. Okay, so that is a path that we're supposed to go. Can we fight these guys up here? They're just background stuff. So let's go check the other path before I commit to that one. If the video cuts off, I'm sorry. 
we'll have to I'll have to break it off in it, another video if it cuts off. It shouldn't though. I don't think I've been for a full 30 minutes because I do try to keep it in the 30 minute block that the game does, or my video program does. Oh man, look at that extra damage from building up the special. Oh god. Wow, that is so much. Better use like a potion. Yeah. Probably important to do. This big guy might do a lot too. <laughs> it's like literally just standing there being beat down. Oh my gosh. Lol. Wow. That's so much experience. We're going to go up definitely at least a level or two. Okay, so we've made it to the same road. No, I have to use another version. Oh, I was healed. Okay. One of my teammates healed me. Nice one, Prompto. Good heals. Yeah. Steely electricity. How far can we go? In the wrong direction. Just can't take a hand. Probably not very far. Oh, Garland Medal of Distraction? <laughs> I guess they're just like, got me for like, going the wrong direction for long enough. They're like, um, you know you're not supposed to go this way, right? Oh, Cactuars? What the smokes? I hope they don't do a thousand needles. That would stink if they did. Nice! Wow! We got cactus needles? That was so great! That's what you get for exploring. Woo! Okay, okay, I'm gonna go back the other way too. 
Oh, that's so great. <laughs> I love exploring in these games. Because you always get, like, cool stuff. I didn't know I was going to run into Cactuars. That's freaking awesome. The other way of distraction is that going to get me a different item? No. No, it's not. That would have been funny if it did. Okay, so I can't go that way. After Rama, we go see Leviathan, right? Indeed. I dare say Lady Lunafreya seeks the Hydra. Okay, so it wouldn't let me go that way even if I tried. She means another right. And a heavier burden. Hope she can hold up. Ice right here. The next save, I'll, I'll, uh, I'll end it right there, so, yeah. This will probably be right after this fight, and then we'll figure out where we're going after that video. It was so cool to pretty much end this almost, almost ended on Cactuars, so yeah. Yeah, that's a good save point. It's saving. This is a perfect place to stop right here. I hope you guys like and subscribe. This has been Mal of RTC1. Thanks.